On today's episode of Podcast Chronicles, we got this man who's going viral on social media for destroying OnlyFans models and sex workers. Just watch the video. A lot of things will be hard for you to comprehend. That's why you're in sex work, because you can't offer value in the marketplace. What the fuck? Don't worry, I'm not really talking to you. I'm speaking against you as a symbol. A symbol of what? A symbol of a declining society where people gotcha. lack values. Mm -hmm. So the point is this. If you had IQ and skills mm -hmm. to offer to the marketplace, gotcha. you can earn a good income. Being that the most valuable thing about you is mm -hmm. something that you never earned. You didn't earn knowledge, you didn't earn skills. It's your breast that you paid for and your butthole. So you market that to earn money, which is to say, if I took your brain and placed your brain into a man's body, you would be in poverty. I'm just good for nothing. Yep, you can't No, you are good for something. That's why you have OnlyFans. And that's my point is that oh, that's what you're good for. Perhaps this phrasing was harsh, but everything he said was 100% true. Sometimes the truth doesn't need sugar coating. You just got to say how it is. OnlyFans has done more damage than good for society. And the people who are really affected in the long term are the women because they get judged a lot by their past. The women who do OnlyFans may think it's a ticket to financial freedom, but they miss how it messes with their dignity. I wholeheartedly believe most of them deep down hate doing it and feel ashamed, but they can't stop doing it because of the financial compensation. They are selling pieces of their soul for quick money. Sooner or later, we are about to see an entire generation of women that realize this too late and end up miserable. But also, while I agree with what he said, we can't also forget the men who have contributed to this failing society. Men created these platforms, men pay for the content, and men pay to be serviced. So if all the simps and losers stop paying for these OnlyFans subscriptions, I believe more and more women will stop doing OnlyFans, but that's just what I think. Let me know what you think in the comments down below.